let's assume that the first term of the arithmetical progression is equal to a. Let's assume that the common difference of this arithmetical progression is equal to d. Therefore, the sum of the first n terms, s1, is equal to n upon 2 times, in brackets, 2a plus n minus 1 times d. The sum of the first 2n terms is equal to 2n upon 2 times, in brackets, 2a plus 2n minus 1 times d. And sum of the first 3n terms, s3, is equal to 3n upon 2 times, in brackets, 2a plus 3n minus 1 times d. Therefore, S2 minus S1 is equal to 2n upon 2 times in brackets 2a plus 2n minus 1 times d minus n upon 2 times in brackets 2a plus n minus 1 times d. Combining the two terms, we get n upon 2 times in brackets 4a plus in brackets 4n minus 2 times d minus 2a minus in brackets n minus 1 times d. This is equal to n upon 2 times in brackets 2a plus in brackets 3n minus 1 times d. Therefore, 3 times s2 minus s1 is equal to 3n upon 2 times in brackets 2a plus 3n minus 1 times d. Notice that this is equal to S3. Therefore, S3 is equal to 3 times S2 minus S1, which is the required result.